being able to see the technologies that we develop in our lab being used in clinical practice, and being able to see the sparkling in the patient's eyes as they use our technologies is, no words can describe that feeling. I am Dr. Tom Carlson, the course director of the new MSc in Rehabilitation Engineering and Assistive Technologies. We're hoping to empower people who have reduced mobility to actually get on with activities of daily living by themselves. You won't just be working in lecture theatres, you won't just be reading material, but you'll really be getting out into the real world. You'll be working with clinicians on projects that have a real clinical need and a clinical pool, but you'll also be working with uh, end users that have real problems that need solving, so you'll be helping them. As a medical student coming from a non-engineering background, I feel that I've gained a range of skills from basic electronics all the way to coding on a range of platforms. I enjoyed having the opportunity to carry out my own experiments, um, recruit participants to that experiment and to then organise that and take control over the way that experiment is run. I think it's an exciting collaboration, the work between the University, RNOH and Aspire. I think it's a great multidisciplinary team with the, you know, the potential for lots of future productive research. I think having patients and ex-patients involved with clinicians, therapists, doctors, nurses and the, the researchers I think must give the best chance of useful productive um, outcomes from research in the longer term. The understanding that the research and practical application need to, to come together to create a difference for the patients that, that we're trying to help and with CREATE being based on site they can come into our therapeutic setting and see what we're doing with our patients and seeing the, the number of modalities that we're using to try and bring patients along and optimise recovery. You, you might be really hooked in the research and want to stay on, pursue a PhD or a research assistant sort of post, but equally you might be inspired to creating some new technology, you might want to be entrepreneurial and we can help you spin out new companies. Um, or you might get more involved in the, the hospital side of things and perhaps work towards becoming a, a clinical engineer or a clinical scientist. This is a really unique opportunity. There are very few MSCs that touch on assistive technology and rehabilitation engineering. And apart from that, this is based in a hospital, so you're really connected with the people that you're trying to help. You're connected with the clinicians. You'd be hard pushed to find something like this elsewhere.